There is a total of 1,260 tossed and 82,695 points this league with the two-week extension. Every player currently in the running for rank 1 can pretty much get all of them done, bar a bit of RNG here and there, and the max points will probably fall around 80 to 81k. Welcome back to another video, I'm sorry for missing an upload yesterday. I was still on the grind, it's just a little bit harder to get the content out as the league pushes on. The fact that people are going to be able to complete almost every single task means efficiency is key. And it doesn't mean anything if I just spam some of the easy points per hour tasks first, if I don't do the slower grinds for the best in slot gear such as the top, for the scythe, and clues for all the best in slot gear. We are rank 3, let's get this bread. And that is 50 league points for completing 200 winter talk kills. I'm actually about to have a salad right now guys, yes, a real life salad keeping you guys updated with my health. We're now at 55,275 points. Winter Todd is a very, very slow points per hour sort of thing. But um, as I get to the higher KCs, like I think the last hard toss is at 225. But as soon as I get to 250, that's a 125 point toss. And all the way up to 350, I think there's three different tasks that are 125 points. So we'll ramp up and it will be more worth it. And it's definitely a grind that a lot of people haven't exactly gotten started at yet. So I don't think it'll be worth it in the long term. Finish eating my salad, we're at 204 Winter Talk KC, probably edge towards 225 as the day goes on. I want to do a mixture of beginner clues to fill that log and pyramid plunder. I think I'm just going to start off doing some clues. I'm going to switch over to pyramid plunder when I have some good content to watch, but first I'm just going to do some beginner clues. Once I got some content to watch, do some pyramid plunder because it is very just like sleep deprived. Well, it's not even sleep, it's just very fucking brain dead content. It makes me want to go to sleep. So having something fun to watch would be nice. Probably five hours of that, then some beginner clues, want to fill the log, probably more hours of that, and then we'll see what we want to do. Alright, I got 16 beginner clues, we'll just open them now. I want to see exactly what we're trying to get here. I think we need to get, oh, I only got 15 out of them. We need to get like four more items with the collection log. If we could just get super lucky and get it now, that'd be amazing. Yeah, okay, we need to get these three items, in fact. Okay, okay, nice. Let's see if we can get any of them. I don't know shit. I literally don't know shit, so yeah. Do we get any of them? 14 out of 16. Okay, we got the bare feet. We only have to get two more. Nice. I'm going to go do some pyramid plunder now. Just chill a bit. And we'll get back to this in a little bit. Okay, and that is five hours or almost six hours for a short little clip. 25 million thieving XP. Now at 55,400. I don't know exactly how many pyramid plunders we've done. But we've got to be very close to the 250 mark. So obviously we'll just keep on going until then because that's another 125 points. But yeah, I have just been spam clicking for the past six hours or so. Bro, finally, that took way longer than expected. It's like, what? I don't know, six, seven hours of work? 250 times, we're done with Pyramid Plunder, we're done with Thieving, 27.4 mil XP. Pretty much all we've done today. Probably just gonna get some KFC treat myself, so... Yeah, go do some Winter Talk while I get that done. 55,525 points now. Alright, let's get back to beginners. Okay, I still- I only need to get the Amulet of Defense trimmed and the Rune Scimitar Ornament Kit Zamorak. So, I don't really need to do that many ones, right? Surely I'll get them in these 18. Spam click. Any shot. Oh, I got the amulet! I actually did get the amulet, so I just need one more now. I just need the... Gothic's thing. I'm pretty sure I get five, 25 points for wearing that as well. Equip the trimmed amulet. Damn! Didn't even know about that. 55,550. Okay. All we need now is the Zamorak kit to complete the log. Could take forever, though. Alright, we got 11 caskets. We're just looking for this last item. Oh, I did it! Did I do it? Wait, what did I get? What did I get? Yeah, fill every beginner clue collection log slot. Let's fucking go. What was the last thing? I don't even know. Oh, it was the runes, uh, rune Skimidar Zamorak kit. Let's go. Damn, I don't have to open any more. I actually thought I would be in for a long grind. Well, I've already, I've done 232. That is quite a bit. But 125 points, 55,675. We take those. That's actually gas, man. 232 beginners done, 125 points, 55,675. I think I want to do some hard clues now because I still need that on Holy Blessing. Um, and I also want to get a full Sardoman outfit, or a full anything outfit. I also want to get the god pages for a god book, because filling a god book is 125 points. Uh, a full dehyde set behind a god is 50 points, and then the Unholy Blessing is best in slot. So I'm not going to open them on Enchana until I finish the armor set, the dehyde set. Once I do that, I'm gonna just going to spam them on the Enchana and hope to get pages for a book, and hope to get the Unholy Blessing. We only have 738 hard clues to do, so I think we should be chilling. Alright, I got an inventory full of shit, I've got all the spell books, I've got last recall in my bank if I need it for a particular step. Doing these hard clues honestly pretty quick comparatively to like maybe some of the other clues that we're doing. I don't know why, I guess it's because we don't really need a lot of items for a lot of them. It's just sort of going places and I feel like we're really well equipped to do that. Already got 6, I'll probably open like every 25 caskets or so, maybe 20, I don't know. Okay, I have 20 caskets and I want some dopamine, so we're just going to start spam clicking them. Obviously, we want a full god set. I think we just need the Sardom and Vams to complete that set, so that would probably be the easiest. Or, 
technically the easiest, but yeah, we'll have to wait and see. Come on, son. A Sardom and Coif. Damn, I don't think I have that actually. Maybe I did. Ancient Coif. Tazar, Kedomke. That's actually super cool. Let's keep going. Keep going. Sardom and Plate Body. Magic Compo. Okay, let's get some of this in the bank. Caskets. Zamorak page three. I don't know if I have that already. Something tells something tells me that I already do. I do need god pages too. That's a big thing that we need. Oh, there's just a bunch of rune items. Gothic's kite shield. Caskets. Um, gilded chain body. Damn. That's really rare. Three more. Let's see if there's anything else for us. Nothing too crazy. Let's look at our collection. All right, so we have three books almost completed. We need the Ancient Page 1, the Sour Dome Page 2, the Zamorak Page 2. So hopefully we can get one of those. And then that's a full God book completed. Um, let's look at the terms of Sour Dome and Dehyde set. Okay, we have the Chaps, the Body, and the Coif. We really just need the Van Braces. All right, all right, all right. We have 20 more caskets. It's time for some dopamine. I'm poisoned, but I don't know. Fuck a poison. Once again, we're looking for the Sar shoes or just to get lucky and complete anything else. And we're also looking for any of these last pages for any of these books. So hopefully we can pull something. Let's get started with the pack opening. Another 20 caskets. Bandos D had body. Master Clue Scroll. Another Unholy Blessing. Damn, that could have been the War Blessing right there. Rune Helm. Rune Plate Legs. Nothing too hot. Nothing too hot yet. Ooh, what's that? A Rune Defender Ornament Kit. Damn. Come on. Oh my god, bro. I got two of the Sar items in one thing. That could have been the shoes right there. I would have traded those two for the shoes, man. What's going on? That is not Pogchamp at all. Rune Shield. Zamorak page four? Does that Zamorak page four do for- Oh, it's a dupe, man. Oh, dupe Zamorak Coif. I'm getting trolled hard. Sardoman page four? I think that's a dupe too, bro. It is. It is. Oh my god. We got three of those. For the culture. Damn it. Robin Hood hat? I don't know if that's a task. I really doubt it. That's super rare, though. Damn, it's not. Four more to go. Armored of Full Home. Damn. A Rune Cane, last one. Damn, pretty much nothing that helps us out there, bro. That's really unfortunate. Still no God Pages, still no God Books, still no Unholy Blessing, still no full Dehyde set, so we go, we go again. Ten more caskets. We're hoping for the same thing. Let's get some dopamine going, please. Ancient page four. Something that tells me that's not the one I need. Nope. That's the dupe again. Ancient plate legs. Ancient full helm. Oh, dear. Dragon boots and rune defender ornament kit. Zamorak bracers. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. This is not too hot, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so still no god book completed. In terms of armor, we're still closest to the Sara set, which we only we don't need the boots or the shield. We literally just need these first four items. So we could also get the Zami set if we got the Zami chaps. Could also get the Bandos set if we got the Bandos chaps. Very, very unfortunate. Sardom and chaps again, bro. I've got like three of them now. That's so troll. All right, probably the last clue for now. I'm getting kind of frustrated. I'm just going to do some Stardust mining and some Rune Dragons probably while I chill, eat some salad, you know, be healthy. But let's see what we get. Are those the shoes? Are those the shoes right there? Oh, I, the shoes don't help. I just got so excited for a singular tick, but then I remember they literally don't help because you need the... I need the Van Braces. The shoes don't matter. The shoes do not matter. All right, so I missed a day of uploading a doobie what a doobie. I just didn't have enough content to put in a video, so I didn't want to release something completely half-assed. So yeah, a doobie what a doobie. I'm going to order some food, do some winter tod, and we'll see what else kind of progress we can make so I can get this video out for you guys well, tomorrow, pretty much. And that is 50 league points for completing 220, 20, 225 winter tod kills. I actually have not got a single Tome of Fire in all these crates. Will this be it? No. But now I start getting 125 points at 250, 300, and 350 winter tod kills. I think I basically have to decide between doing this or uh, what's it called, Temporos, because there's also a 350 task for that. And um, I just didn't do Temporos, so, <laughs> you know, I committed to Winter Todd early, and that's just what we're going to do. I'm at 237 Winter Todd KC. I'm going to go do a Shooting Star. I'm now in the Shooting Star CC. Shout out to them. Uh, I'm just, like, I don't know. I'm too tired to actually do anything, man, so I'm just going to stack up my Stardust, and I think that's all good. Damn, this is a size 8 star. That's huge. Solid 30 minutes of work, 4k dust now. Let's get back to Winter Todd. 
And that is 250 Winter Todd kills. Still no Tome of Fire. It's not a task, but I would like one. 55,850 850 points now. I can also go do one more thing for another quick 50 points. 250 Winter Todd kills. You're probably wondering how my mental health is. And after Iron Joe and Mr. Beast Fan 69 have been flaming me no matter which brazier I'm at, let me tell you, it's in the fucking bin. Now, I can't afford therapy, but what can you afford is a Ditter Bitter subscription. It's free, and it's the best way we can finesse this YouTube algorithm into getting my channel and videos out there, and we're super, super close to 110k, and I know you guys are for the kids. Maybe one day I'll be able to see someone. Remember, I still have 100 Winter Todd to go, so I really do appreciate you guys doing this. Somehow I've lost my prospective shoes. That's not a good look, but um, I'm just going to get a 50-point toss real quick to trade in some... What's it called? I want a star fragment for 3k, and if I use that on that, that makes a gold prospector outfit, or just one piece of it, so that's 50 points right there. Or 25 points right there, my bad. It's a 125 point toss to wear the whole thing. I don't know where my prospective boots have gone. That's not great. I'll probably have to go get those back, I guess. I just got another pyromancer garb. But we're now at 55,875 points. I have a bunch of crafting supplies, whether it be gems, uh, dehyde, or battle staffs. I'm at what? I'm only at 13.3 mil. I'm not sure what XP will get me to, but if I get close to 25 mil, I might just go gem store the rest for a quick 125 points. I'm tanning a bunch of hides right now, but uh, there actually is a shooting star landing in a couple minutes, so I'll probably go to that. Just want to stack those up while I can get them, because I still need 9,000 more or 8,000 more shooting dust or whatever it's called, stardust. And there's one here. What is it? A size 2 star. What's this? I was the first person to find it, and it's a size 8. I was just in a, I was just in a world with a size 2, bro. I hopped to a different world, and there's a size 8 one. We're bing chillin'. Bro, I genuinely might have this all to myself. No one else has came. Damn, someone finally pulled up. 2k poem that. Very, very nice. We have like 3k out of the 9k we need for the rest of the Prospector set. Just got done tanning all my dehyde. There's a fragment I'm gonna use that actually saves 40% of the dehyde as well. Here, you can see all of my other stuff. Let's get the rest of my crafting XP in there, too. All right, only got 500 battle staffs to make, and then we have some uncut gems too. I probably have some diamonds as well, and the emeralds. Not gonna use the onyxes, probably not worth it. Let's see what XP this can get to it. This can get us to. All right, that's all the gems done. I forgot we had a bunch of molten glass too, so that should help. We're at 15.3 mil XP. Let's get started on the what's it called, the molten glass. That's all the molten glass done. We are now at 17.4 mil XP. We got all this dehyde and still the staffs to go. All right, dehyde's pretty much done too. We're at 21.7 mil. We've only got 540 battle staffs to make. Okay, we're officially out of crafting supplies. We got a little bit of leather here or there, but not really anything at all. We are at 22.7 mil, so we need like 2.3 mil XP. I think I'm just gonna go do the gem store. There are better things I can do, some more efficient things, but I just want these uh, 125 points, so it's not the biggest deal. Time is whatever. I only need 2.3 mil XP, which is like 143k normal game XP, so shouldn't be too many gems that we have to buy. I don't even think I have to sell any Chaos Rings for Talk Love. What do you got? 228k? All right, spent a little time buying some gems, and now we should be good to get this crafting level. Let's go. Let's do it. And that is 25 mil crafting speed. Bought a couple more gems than I actually needed to. A clean 56,000 leagues points. Very, very nice. Leagues came out on January 19th, and it is currently February the 16th. I have completed 982 tasks and received 56,000 points in that time out of the 1,265 tasks. That means I have completed 78% of this game and all challenges it has to offer in less than a month and we've still got a month to go. So if you don't believe me about completing every single task, think again. Guys, we have a YouTube algorithm to conquer. Drop a comment down below, tell me how you enjoyed the video, tell me how you enjoy the progress when it is a little bit slower like this, and whether you still like the daily videos. I know you guys said in yesterday's video you guys do really love them, and I really did like seeing that sort of reception, but I understand if it is a bit slow for some of you guys. Leave a like, and the most important thing, double check that you are subscribed, We're super close to 110k, and that is the biggest factor in getting my channel out there. Thank you guys for watching, and I will hopefully see you tomorrow. I'm going to really try to get you guys another video.